I'm wearing pajamas. Hey everyone, I'm on off like a light switch, and I finally graduated from university. So I graduated with a bachelor's of science in neuroscience. I chose neuroscience as my major and I'm glad I chose it. When I was applying to college, my last year of high school, my senior year of high school, the application asked you to choose a major. I was thinking about going the pre-mad route, uh, pre-mad, <laughs> pre-mad route. Might as well be pre-mad because that's what it was, four years. <laughs> Anyways, so I was thinking about going the pre-med route. I thought biology was a good, safe major to choose. But then I thought back to my time in AP Biology in high school that, yo, hmm, the nervous system's kind of cool. It, it was one of the coolest things about the human body. So when I started college, I immediately switched from biology to neuroscience. So what exactly do you learn in neuroscience? Well, you learn about the nervous system from an anatomical level of the central nervous system, of the brain, the spinal cord, and the peripheral nervous system, uh, and then all the way down to the cellular level, basically a neuron, cell of the nervous system. But it's a lot more complicated than just that. The main classes you take, just to name a few, are cellular neuroscience, neurophysiology, neuropharmacology, and neuroanatomy. Neuroanatomy has a bunch of different parts of the nervous system that you gotta memorize these parts and their function, their disorders, and even neuropharmacology, you learn about drugs that affect the nervous system that are used for treatment and other things that can influence the activity of our neurons and the nervous system. I learned about circuits in neurophysiology, like biophysics. Neurons are basically circuits. In cellular neuroscience, you just talk about the cells the neurons and the, and the nervous system and how they work, basically. I'm putting it very simple. I'm not gonna go into depth. Anyway, those are just a few classes just to be brief. What can you do with a neuroscience major? Well, you can do research. Research is a big field in neuroscience since there's so much about the nervous system and the disorders that arise from the nervous system that we don't really understand to the fullest extent. You can teach students if you enjoy the academic side. If you wanna be a dentist, you can go on the pre-dental track and if you're interested in medicine, you can major in neuroscience and go with the pre-med track and apply to medical school. That's the road that I chose, and thankfully I'll be starting medical school in the fall. If you choose neuroscience as your major, you're gonna get reactions from people. Wow, neuroscience? That sounds really hard. Wow, wow, that, wow, that's, mm. You'll get this reaction every time. One time I got this reaction from someone who was majoring in physics and he was studying antimatter. Antimatter, he was studying antimatter and he said, he gave me the same reaction and he said, dang, I have no idea what that is. That sounds complicated. And I'm over here thinking, wow, you're studying antimatter and you're telling me that what I'm studying is complicated or like, it sounds, sounds hard. Antimatter to me was crazy. It was just a funny thing that he was studying something insane and he thought I was studying something insane. I'll be honest though, it was a bit of a struggle. I did have some struggles uh, going through this degree. I mean, I went through it, I got through it. It is a bit of a struggle and you have two options. One, switch majors, choose a different career that you feel more comfortable with, or two, focus, be determined, you got this, and don't let a class or two get you in the way of pursuing your dreams and goals in life. If you make a mistake, you should learn from it. Whatever it may be, in exams, quizzes, studying, all these different things. As you go on in your educational journey, just avoid the mistakes and just keep on doing what you're doing that's helping you succeed. That kind of applies to anything though. That's for literally every anything that you can imagine. For any career, any path you choose in life. To sum it up, if you think the nervous system is cool and you want to learn more about it, choose neuroscience as your major. This major is interesting. This subject is interesting. But what comes with that interesting subject is how complicated it is. So you'll definitely have to study. You might face a few bumps along the way, but you'll manage to get through it. In the end, I give neuroscience a 10 out of 10, would take it again, but not really, because that was a long four years. If you want more videos like this, let me know in the comments below. I know this video has been a little bit different from my past videos, but that's because I just wanted to get informed. Anyone that wanted, was interested in college and wanted to maybe do a neuroscience major, and I just wanted to be a little informative, but I'll go back to the old comedy sketches, comedy vlogs, and whatnot. So if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed already, and I'll see you bulbs in the next video.